It's the Chicago White Sox taking on the Cleveland Guardians. And, now, and we'll be back for the first pitch right after this. First pitch moments away. And starting in this one, Yuri Perez. And Singy, he likes pitching at home. Well, truly for him, there is no place like home. He's been so dominant here. And as a teammate, you expect him when pitching at home this year to go out and dominate just as he has. The fans expect it. And I think everyone around here knows that he's a good pitcher. Even though we don't see the same splits on the road, we're going to start to see that translate as well. Severino kicks deals. Ball one now, there. One ball, one strike. Right guy, right spot. Come on now, kid. Severino. So a foul ball makes it one and two. Well, you put good velocity in the head of the hitter. He's got to get it ready early and then change speeds. Keep him off balance. That's the goal. Yep, Next pitch is outside. Out. And now the count filled up three and two. Tough take right there. He swings at that more often than not. And that one is lifted in the air. And there's one down. Batting second. The designated hitter. Drew. Welcome back. New inning getting started. And now it's Luis Robert. Pretty amazing athlete this guy is. Power and speed, quite a threat. I mean, you're talking about someone that could steal your bag and go deep. Bo Jackson, anyone? That's towards center. Paquez settles under it. And out number one on the grab. Back now at Progressive Field. Bottom of the fourth. So in now for Cleveland, Emmanuel Paquez. Severino back to work. And first offering is fouled off. Left hand batter waits. That's a ball. I got a ball, one strike. Swing and a miss. And the count, one and two. Wow, no fair right there. I mean, that slider didn't move to the very last moment. Incredibly difficult to pick that up. Just kind of have to tip your cap on that pitch. Get a good rip on it, huh? And the righty deals. Swing and a miss. That one in the dirt. In time to get him. One away in the strikeout. Back to the top of the lineup. Here's the Cleveland leadoff hitter, Emmanuel Paquez. A guy who makes an impact not just at the plate, but also in the field. Puts it in the air out towards left center. Vaughn on his way in. And that's the third out. The Guardians go down in order. And it remains... Now it's the White Sox catcher, Dan Burroughs. The catcher, number 13. Dan Burroughs. Right-handed reliever. He swings and hits a fly ball. Center field. Makes the catch inning over. Nothing doing for the White Sox, but they still lead it 1-0. So the batting order turns over, and here is Emmanuel Paquez. Good contact guy, good defender. And it's fouled away. Now, Boog, this is a real tough place for visiting teams to come in and close out ball games for a win. Next offering is downstairs.
Righty delivers. Swing and a ground ball up the middle. That's a base hit. Oh, that at bat had a lot riding on it. Certainly a pivotal swing of the bat in this ball game. Just kept it simple. Played Pepper with the middle of the infield and took it back where it came from. And there's just no one there to knock it down. Now a huge at bat in this game coming up. Drew Waters stands in. And the pitch. These home fans, they are making a lot of noise, putting pressure on that pitcher out there. Move to first, and he's back in there. Hey, dripping and ripping, kid. Let's go. Hey, it's your pitch, drive it. Here comes a pitch. Run around the goal, and he walked him. They're not ready to go home quite yet. Now it's Jose Ramirez. And Boog, I'd say he's due. Well, they're applying pressure, quality at bats, quality swings right now, and see this offense doing it one man to the next, showing a lot of fight right now, and they're making it difficult. Oh, now this ball's going to get through, and that's a base hit. Throw comes in quickly, and the tying run forced to hold on at third with one away. These guys today are so great with handling velocity. They're seeing high speeds day after day, and a nice job of turning that one around. And now it's Bobby Bradley. And there's no doubt that they'll feed off the energy from this crowd, right? I mean, yeah, I'd say the intensity level has gone up a few notches for sure. To first, maybe a two ball. To second for one. The double play ends it right here. Well, this one was all about the pitching and defense. Outstanding job of the pitchers, really attacking hitters, trusting what the catcher was putting down, and trusting the guy standing behind him to make the plays defensively. Sometimes you want to see a high-scoring game, but sometimes you can appreciate the artistic beauty of what these guys did on the mound today. one nothing the final for Chris Singleton and our entire crew here at MLB The Show.